Yeah, nobody has medals like me. You, you can tell who's got pussy and who don't, you know? Just what? Like medals. Yeah, I got two purple medals. That's just stupid. Honestly, I, I think we should give every every zoo animal amphetamines and they kind of watch the zoo just change for the better. What? Zoo animals have amphetamines? Yeah, just give the, give the give the giraffes like a shit ton of amphetamine. See what see what they do. It's for science. The zoologists will go crazy for it. You know, cigarettes are like slow motion. It takes a long time to get cancer. Yeah, it's like slow motion suicide smoking. If if you really want to go to the cancer ward, give them some fucking uranium. I'm gonna invoke some thoughts on them, have them talk a little bit, let them just let them just you know be themselves. I guess I'll put like yeah that that Skyrim NPC music on us, bro. Do you guys hear about, like, uh, weed being, like, uh, decriminalized? Decriminalized. I mean, you know, it's perfectly legal in most states. They should also decriminalize Gaddafi. Gaddafi, shut up, man, after we fucking killed his fucking baby. Also him. He's also quite dead. He's been he's been rather silent since his people dragged him out of a hiding hole. But honestly, I think the bloated, rotting corpse of Gaddafi make a pretty good leader. Do you, do you remember uh, Bush attacking Gaddafi? I think it was might have been Reagan. I, I don't remember. Uh, I think it was under Obama finally killed. Yep, so weed's legal. <laughs> so weed's here, boss. I can't remember Gaddafi. I think that was Reagan that took him out. Or shut his ass no, up. No, he, he died about like 2009-ish. Well, I think it was Reagan that shut his ass up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. That shut Gaddafi up. If they're silent long enough, I'm gonna say, what do you guys think about Biden? Yeah, what do you guys think about Biden? Oh! I think he sucks. He's I mean, not the best, but he, we, could, we could have worse. Yeah, I, I guess we could have people like Jeffrey Dahmer and Charles Manson. I mean, like, there, there could be people who are definitely worse to have in charge during the whole Ukraine thing. You know, I told a bunch of people, I, I told them when Biden got elected, I said, wait till you fucking pay $4 a gallon for gas. And they're like, oh, you're stupid. I mean, okay, in, in his defense, the president doesn't determine the price of gas. That, that, that's due to a lot of other uh, factors. Uh, the, the, like well, in Russia, now, well, Russia well, is well, a large provider of oil. Well, well, when the president stops the key, Keystone Pipeline, you don't think that determines shit? But the price of gasoline wasn't $4 during that point. No, I mean, because, you know, it's speculation. And with the Keystone Pipeline in action, speculation was good for low fuel prices. Yeah, but, but when they stopped it... Because I completely agree with you, brother. <laughs> when they stopped the Keystone Pipeline, fucking gas prices just rose. Well, okay, I, uh, here's the thing, though. Like, gasoline right now is an inelastic demand. It's like, it's never, the demand for gas is never going to stop. But, and, and again, companies can keep raising the same price, the, raising the price. I blame Biden, but you guys can think whatever you want. I do like Biden because he has made it mandatory that girls raise their skirts fucking 10 inches. What? I do like Biden on that account. <laughs> what? That's kind of gay though, brother. I mean, if you like pedophile as your president, then, then whatever. I mean, the only reason people didn't so like Trump because he got an attitude. Black. But he was a good president. Just had a bad attitude. We, we were not looked favorably upon them at the world stage during that time. I'm, I'm not like saying anything about my my own personal opinions. Just saying like the world did not care for us too much. Do you think the world? True. Do you think the world has ever cared for us? Yeah. Ever at any <laughs> point in time. Yes. Teach them bitches some respect. Well, you're highly mistaken. Yes, they hate easy, us in the United know. Nations. But the the UN has a headquarters in New York. You know, I guarantee you this Ukraine shit wouldn't be going on right now if Bush, if uh, Trump was in office. Guaranteed, guaranteed, fucking teed, guaranteed it wouldn't be going on if Trump was in office. Guaranteed. I, I, I know Great for a brother. fucking fact. Yeah, I guarantee that Ukraine shit would not be going on right now if Trump was in office. What do you mean by that? What would uh, Trump do differently, do you think? Well, I just don't you got think, the baddest don't think in town. Uh, Russia would have had the balls to fucking go into Ukraine if Trump was in office, to be quite honest with you. What? We're already fucking with Ukraine when Trump was still in office. Well, okay, well, did they do anything until Trump yes, left they office? Yes, fucking annexed Crimea. Well, whatever. You know, if, if, if you're a fucking billionaire, you're allowed to be arrogant, and that's just the rules. Oh my god, bro, you definitely have a truth social account, for real. You know, Biden reminds me of fucking Jimmy Carter. Yeah, Jimmy Carter was pretty smart, though. He was a nuclear engineer. He was a peanut farmer. And a nuclear engineer. Well, why'd he end up fucking farming peanuts? His brother uh, Billy was, was done with the fucking U.S. Navy. He went to go farm peanuts.
Well, you know, politics are something that people are going to argue about till the dawn of time. Till the dawn of time. You know, I don't like Biden, and there's no secret about that. I don't like women, to be honest. You don't like women? They should go their place. You know, women their keep their eyes... Their to the stove. Women keep their eyes closed during sex for one reason and one reason only. It's because you can't see a man have a good time. Oh. My. God. You got the baddest crew in town. Oh, my God. And if you don't agree with that, you never had sex. I'm into gays. I don't like gays. That's probably why you like minutes. Biden. Like, I, I occasionally platonically suck my homie off, but, like, it, it's platonic. Well, I understand why you like Biden now. I'm Orange, uh, if I may interject, you're uh, trying a little bit too hard here. God bless. No, I, mean, I just I just really like men. Oh, doubling down. That's even worse. Uh, God bless again. I, I really like men. I hope one day I get fucking trafficked as a male prostitute. You're trying really hard, bro. Like, the joke was over a long time ago. I'm not joking. This is embarrassing at this point. Okay, okay, okay. You guys know that conversion therapy, right? Electroshock, you know, you, you turn, make gay person straight. Well, see, I, unfortunately, I was fucking like about an outlet and I stuck some Big yawn, bro. Bored. Yeah, we're not really interested in this sentence, bro. Anyways, anyone else got an actual funny joke to tell? I do. When I was the sheriff of Alabama, we found a black man shot in the head nine fucking hundred times. And I swear to God, that was the worst case of suicide I had ever seen. I don't even know what to say, dude. Just, like. I know you expect me to say what, well, but are you, are you really surprised? surprised? Somehow I, I do not think the Holocaust happened. I don't think Germany even had the infrastructure to make that happen. Orange, it's like you like have seen like trolls on YouTube or something, and you're like you're trying to emulate that behavior, like but like you've never heard them I'm before not, or something at the same kidding. time. No, like really you're just like unbearably like opinion. unfunny and like you're trying then too hard. Then fucking mute me, cunt, mute me. Who says cunt, bro? Like a male that says cunt? Me. Do you have glasses? It's because he voted for Biden, yep. brother. You got the you do have glasses? I, I can literally hear what I you sound like. Greasy vote. bowl cut. I mean, I, I, I'm serious. They did a survey. Everybody that voted for Biden, their, their IQ was below 80. I don't even know what to say, bro. It's like just, honestly, it's kind of inspiring to see a man just so boldly say things that, that no one's ever dared to just just say to strangers for no reason, bro. Yo, thank you, Jello. Thank you, man. Thank you. You know, and, and besides, I don't even think Biden actually won the election. I think fucking voter fraud was in place. Like stolen votes and shit? Absolutely. You know, guys, Tell you know, straight up, fresh. straight up, I was a pilot for the Navy for fucking 40 years. I, I'm, I'm 60 years old, to be straight up with you. You guys are probably going to call me a freak for what I'm about to say, but there's some strange shit up fucking flying around out there. There's no and way this is all real. I'm gonna say about that. I saw shit make fucking turns that would make fucking anybody fucking vapor on a wall. I mean, how can anybody survive a fucking 50 G turn? Well, they don't call them UFOs anymore. They call them brother, aerial phenomenals. I... I saw shit make right angle turns that would fucking put vapor on a wall for any pilot that was in that aircraft. You know, when you report shit like that, they fucking they fucking put you in fucking psycho ward. Send it to Infowars. Send it to Infowars. No, you don't report oh, shit oh, like that. You know, a fucking three and a half G turn will fucking almost make a person pass out. How can somebody take a 50 G turn? They're like orbs, orange orbs that fucking just maneuver. There's no body to them. They're orbs. Orange orbs is all I can tell you. Bro, Vegeta, bro. You be, you've been looking at Dragon Balls, I think. I saw them one time. One time only. It was an orange orb that made a 50 G turn. I've been drinking ever fucking since. I think it's something from a not of this earth. To be honest with you. You know, I fought in the uh, uh, Gulf War and I blew up more bridges than I guarantee any of you have ever crossed before. I've crossed a lot of bridges, my friend. Uh, I blew up a lot of bridges. That's all we did in the Gulf War. Blow up bridges. That's all my squadron did. Yeah, I don't know what was going on in the whole war, but my job was to blow up bridges. I didn't join the military, but I've been burning bridges myself. Especially the way I've been talking to women lately. Yeah, yeah I understand I'm burning bridges, but I'm blowing them up. Facts, facts. That's right. But that was in the 90s, bud. You know, can you imagine how old I am? My guess is going to have to be like 60. 61. In May. I don't think he remembers 61. that he told us his age. Yeah, 60. Damn, I had a pretty good guess. Yeah. yeah well, Damn, you know, hell, I was a pilot in fucking the 90s. He loves saying that, bro. Are any of you in the military? I have squad the game. Nobody's in the military. It's really kind of scary, man. I mean, I was scared. I feared for my life, man. They got SAM sites and all that fucking bullshit. Oh, like Rust.
I know our technology is about 10 times greater than the fucking fucking Iraqis. So when you engage a fucking plane in fucking Iraq, I mean, you, you, I mean, all you got to do is fire a fucking sidewinder and he's down. You know, you can fire a fucking sidewinder before you even see the fucking plane. You know, you, you never even get visual contact before you shoot him down. I mean, that's the beauty of being in America. Yo, what happened in Benghazi, though? You know, I was out, I was out of the damn Navy. I was a Navy. I was a Navy man, not an Air Force. Damn, it almost got a straight answer for once. I almost solved the problem, bro. Yeah, fucking landing on an now. aircraft carrier is a bitch. You what? fucking miss your arrestor hook. You know how many times I had to, to go by and make a flyby? Dozens, if not hundreds. Yeah, a lot, a lot, a lot of times. Yeah, if you miss your fucking arrestor hook, man, you're fucked. You know, you just gotta make a flyby. How do you feel about immigration, brother? Oh shit! Oh shit! Bro, let out the the heavy. Who's, who's immigrating? Oh no! Yeah, Grandpa, no, Grandpa, we're gonna take you inside before yeah, you scare I off all the bitches. You, I told you when I was the sheriff of Alabama, didn't I? You were really the uh, sheriff in Alabama? Yeah, we found a black man shot in the head nine fucking hundred times, and that, and, I, and that was the worst case of suicide I had ever seen. That's a joke. Oh, good. <laughs> I thought he was serious. Yeah, you guys are saying what? Like, he already said this, so like, we're, the shock factor's gone for us. No, I retired as a full colonel. Does well, the military a, still I'm do a, prestiging? Slain. Like on Call of Duty, I got in a 10th prestige lobby. This guy gave me all of the guns and camo, and I, uh, I was able to get to the next rank. Not sure about that. I think that's only in the Marines. 60 years old, man, and I'm kicking these guys' ass. Let me, uh, let me pull a clip off of my favorite band. Hang on. Please don't be like Alabama N bomb or something, please, bro. Please, just just play something normal, bro. Please. No way. <laughs> Yo, what kind of truck you drop? F two fifty. How did you know it was a truck? Didn't even have to ask. And I drank fucking Bud Ice beer. Yeah, guys, man, I just want to let you know, man, um, there's something going on out there in this world that is not from this earth. Just letting you know, being a pilot for 40 years, there's something going on out there. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's, it's, it's <laughs> our fucking shit or it's something from not of this earth. I don't know. I mean, that's the way it is. If it's our shit, then we ain't got nothing to ever worry about. Bro, it's an NPC that we just fucking started the conversation over. I mean, you know over. how fucking CIA is. You never know. It, you know, like, when you complete the quest with the NPC, he's, like, out of line, so he just says, like, one default Fuck line? That guy. That's what he's doing right now. Like, we already completed the quest or something. If it's our shit, then, guys, we ain't got nothing to worry about ever. If it's not, then something's visiting, visiting us from out of this world. Yo, when were you a pilot? From about 1987 to about 1998. That's not 40 years. The numbers aren't really adding up, but it's all good, brother. Am I really about to find out this whole time I've been talking like a schizophrenic guy? Like entertaining his bullshit? Is that really what I'm about to find out right now? Because it, it honestly feels a lot like that's exactly what's happening. Yo, good game, guys. Yo, green, you want Q, bro? You heard me, green, you want Q? Um, green. But... I feel like hazy reading this. I feel sick. This game is full of hackers. If you start out new, your first comp game will be full of hackers that you can see hacking as you get more into the game and users have badges, but they are still hacking, but only using wall hacks or rage aim hacking if it's a closed comp match. I have over 2,000 wins in comp and only 5% of those games went hack free or were hack free. Steam really does not seem to care. Trust mode only produced more hackers whoa, whoa, whoa. than I saw. D no He's way. Is he in my game again? I'm what? Literally reading his profile, he's in my game, bro. What? He already forgot about you? Yeah, I think so. Cats. What's going on, everybody? I just, uh, I'm on, I'm on break from the military right now. I'm on leave. I'm a U.S. Army 11 Bravo. Infantry wow. right you know, I was, I was, I was in the fucking, uh, Navy for fucking 30 years. Straight up, I was a pilot for the Navy for fucking 40 years. Bro, Christ. he subtracted 10 years. I fought in the Gulf War. No way, really? Yeah, I fucking blew up more bridges than you ever crossed in your lifetime. Oh shit, when were you a pilot? Uh, from 19, 1987 to 1999. Yo, when were you a pilot? From about 1987 to about 1998. You know, I was in your last game, and 
you're full of shit because you said you were in the you were in for forty years, and you also said different years. Yo. No, 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 no. Yeah, no yeah, way. yeah. I literally was in your last game, bro. You're full yeah, of yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 man. You said 40 years last game. Now you're saying 30. I said I was a pilot for 30, 40 years. I was a pilot for the Navy for fucking 40 years. How does that make sense, bro? You said you're in the military, bro. I have it recorded, bro, because you're being a crazy old oh, well, bastard. Well, you're lying. Homie is here with a stolen Valor. Let me he literally recap, is, bro. He literally is doing stolen so Valor on CSGO. You were in his last game, and he fucking claimed. He said he was a pilot for 40 years, and now he's 30. That's why I said something. No, I'm not no, in the military. No, 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 You're a man. fucking liar, bro. You're a lying old bastard, bro. Oh, bitch. Oh, Fuck bitch. you, man. Fuck you. Fuck you, bro. Fucking I suck. I said it in the last game, man. No, you said 40 years. Now you're saying 30, bro. What a loser, bro. You could be as drunk I as you want to. Anyone pilot. in the military is not forgetting that, bro. Even if you're talking about being a pilot, how does it change from 40 to 30? Make it make sense, bro. Literally. Where'd those 10 years Thank go? Thank you, Blue. Thank you, Blue. I said a pilot. Man, you I a lying guy, bastard, dude. bro. You ain't no military. Military, right, you ain't right, never did shit. You, man. Fuck you, man. I'm fixing to kill you, Blue. You're fixing to kill me? This game. Yeah, <laughs> hell yeah. Goddamn right. Why don't you fix to accomplish something in your life instead of pretending to be in the military, you fucking loser? Did you say you had a small dick, Blue? Because yeah, you want to come suck it? No, nah, not really. You're sitting there pretending to be in the fucking Navy, bro. You're literally pretending to be a fucking Hold seaman, bro. You know, you know, Blue is fucking got a small fucking, you know, you know, fucking, fucking, a small fucking a small dick. Yeah, why did you pull that? Like, where'd that come from? Small dick joke. You said in the last game that you were 60, then you said you were 61, bro. You lie about everything. I said that I will be 61 in fucking May. Oh, so you remember God that, damn. but you don't remember saying 40 years instead of 30. Exactly, I just got you again, bitch. I this said I was a pilot like fucking... for fucking 40 years, you dumb motherfucker. Alright, ask me any fucking question you want, you goddamn All right, how does it feel to be a loser that's never done anything in his life and pretends to be in the military? That's my first question. My next question is, Blue, how does it feel to be fucking dead? You're gonna take a cooldown over this because we caught you? Come on, bro. I'll, Good, wait, I'll, I'll wait fucking 10 seconds before I shoot you, Blue. Shut up, old man. I'm gonna put you in retirement home. You keep talking like that. What are you fucking shooting at, old man? Grips, Blue. You're fucking hacker. I'm not hacking. What are you talking about? Get owned, kid. You're you suck. You're a fucking hacker, you goddamn faggot, motherfucker. <laughs> you goddamn fucking got fucking B-hop scripts. <laughs> Blue's fucking hacking. Mask off. <laughs> fucking mask off. <laughs> God, bro. I can't believe you lie about that on CSGO. We're already pretending to be in the military on the game, bro. Literally. You know, guys, you can check it. It's fucking on fucking Facebook. And he kept talking about his fake stories about aliens, bro. I, said, I, I encountered them once. Orange orbs. Yes. I said they made 90 degree turns. <laughs> that would be juice on the wall at 50 fucking G experience. turns. Do you hear this right now? Yes, what the fuck is going on? On the other hand, good round, though. You got the world is cool in time. I recorded that. That was brilliant. brilliant. Well, shit. <laughs> He got offline, bro. He literally fucking, bro. He literally fucking closed his game, bro. He got offline. He, he closed Steam. He's done.